What's going on, fam? It's the Entertainer, Motivate, Educate, Lucky Murray, back with another Game Caught News update on my phone tonight. Uh, tomorrow, look out for the podcast on the Patreon. Um, that's the Lucky Murray podcast. We're going to discuss a lot of these different issues, but uh, the few issues I want to talk about. Uh, the first issue, the first thing is we do have another running back who is in the transfer portal. Um, what's his name? What's his name? What's his name? I want to get his name right real quick. Uh, Rashad Amos. Um, didn't really see a whole lot of touches. Decided to go to the transfer portal. Uh, this is his, uh, he joined a program in 2020, so this is technically his uh, freshman or sophomore year or whatever. I'm looking to play more. Um, again, you know, like there's an opportunity there. Uh, if you're patient and work hard, you may get the opportunity. A lot of guys in the NIL situation, they do not want to wait. If they don't play today, uh, their internet name in the transfer portal, whether or not they will get signed. A lot of these guys do not get signed. That's a, that's the thing that uh, these transfer portal guys they 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 think the grass is green on the other side. Put their name out there, and half the guys that put their name in the portal actually get uh, signed. A lot of them drop down to D two, D three level. So um, nothing but the best for Rashad. Um, he is uh, into his transfer name, uh, tra- name in the transfer portal. Another guy that declared that he's going to stay for us last year, uh, DK Joyner, uh, the carry on. Um, I think that's a much classy move, man. I, I'm tired of seeing on Twitter where a lot of these guys, they put out these elaborate posts that are pre-marketed, pre-planned. You know, uh, first of all, I would like to thank my coaches and God because without them and my family. And it's like, listen, if you're going to transfer, transfer. You know, um, and they put their official statement out on Twitter. For me, I'm thinking, listen, man. Good luck wherever you need to go. But D- DK, uh, he could have transferred. And nobody in South Carolina would have blamed the young man for transferring. Um, he came in as a talented uh, uh, Mr. S- South Carolina football out of uh, Fort Dorchester down there in Charleston. Um, and came to South Carolina after two years. The Will Muschamp regime put him at wide receiver. Uh, he played some quarterback, some wide receiver. Uh, has been a utility player. But the fact that he loves South Carolina, the fact that he wants to finish a Gamecock, um, nothing, 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 nothing but great things for uh, this young man. And I hope that we can find a way to utilize him this next year coming up. This year, I feel like we didn't utilize him enough. I think his touches went to um, uh, A.B., uh, A. Brown. Um, and I think that we did not give uh, the carry-on touches that he needed to get touches. Now, he had a lot more touches when it came to the Gator Bowl, but I think it's too little too late, man. Let that man rock and roll. Um, so another um, rumor that I want to talk about real quick before I end this video is that there's speculation that Spencer Rattler and um, Juice Wells will declare for the NFL draft. Now, I was on record saying that I think that Spencer Rattler is going to stay. But I do think that... Um, with this uh, things that are happening, um, Spencer Rattler may be out of here. So our starting quarterback next year may be uh, Luke Doty and or the other quarterbacks that's, that's in the back. Uh, so it may seem like that Spencer Rattler is uh, trying to go to the NFL. I would think it would be a mistake, but hey, listen. Um, who am I? I'm just lucky. I'm just a man behind the camera. Uh, but that's what I heard. Uh, I know Chris from the, the Spurs up show uh, reported it on Twitter and a few other things that I've been seeing. So I just want to talk to y'all real quick. But let me know what you think about the comment section below. Uh, what do you think about this news right here? Write in the comment section below. Get us to entertain and motivate, educate, and please don't forget all three. Like you remember, another game cut news update today, man. We got a lot of news stories. Couldn't really get to the Gator Bowl. I think I'm going to talk about it on my podcast tomorrow. Uh, I was out of town uh, with my family, so I didn't get a chance to post one out. But Happy New Year's, everybody. Uh, 23 is going to be an awesome year. Y'all let me know what you think about this in the comment section below. But like always, it's the next time, people.